Hey everybody. I think I'm actually going to try using a controller this time just because my wrist is still a little sore. I don't know why. Dude. I wonder if it's because of all that editing I did. <laughs> For the, the Halloween stuff. And then it finally caught up with me yesterday. Hello, dress crew. You you look like a a newer face. And blaze and sleepy. And sword. My favorite species of bird. Probably the crow. Crows are pretty cool. My day's going fine, thank you for asking. Okay. Plug and play so far, that's a good sign. Alright, so we were just starting chapter 4. That was where we left off last time. Yeah, you're awake. I... I saw Chicory. You saw her? Inside the tree. What's going on? It's as I feared. The darkness that rises from below. I think it is connected to Chicory. But... I mean, it wasn't real, right? The thing she said in there. You need to speak with Chicory. Confront her about this. She won't listen to me anymore. But maybe you. Alright, I guess we need to... Go talk with Chicory. I don't know what the buttons are now because I'm using the... Uh... It doesn't look like I can swim in the paint. Let me see here. What are the... I can't even get to the normal menu. Uh... Okay, brush color, brush size... RSB, what is that? Someone's gonna have to explain to me what an RSB button is. Oh yeah, look at swim isn't set to anything. Okay, um... I don't think we need an alt confirm, so I'll set the swim to that, I guess. Right stick button, but isn't... I thought that RB would meant the right stick button. No? Okay. Oh wait, this is gonna use Y. Uh-oh. Hmm. Okay, how about, let's try this. How about that? Alright, let's see how that works. Well, it's the, the swim wasn't assigned to anything either, though, so I still needed to do that. 
So now I can just jump. So that will explain how I'm able to uh, reach some things that I wasn't able to reach before. <clears throat> it wasn't assigned anything because I didn't have the brush. Well, why was my other ability assigned to something before I even had the ability? <laughs> that doesn't seem to line up. Um. Oh, this is a lot trickier with the joysticks. Clown. Well, I would use the mass sword, but I don't know if you heard me, my, my wrist is actually still sore from yesterday, which is unusual. I don't know if I should, like, like just using, browsing the computer earlier was hard, I could feel it. There's another cat up Use my elbow. Um, hmm. Okay. Oh yeah, we need we need to go back to luncheon, right? So we can talk to uh Hickory. Why is that bad ergonomically? I've never heard this before. I mean, I can understand why using your arm would be better for your wrist, but it also feels like the equivalent of like moving your head back and forth to read instead of like using your eyeballs. That's what worries me, like I usually, my wrist usually doesn't hurt. The only time my wrist will get sore is if I like, have been doing some like really heavy, uh, like video editing sessions. But even then, it's pretty rare. I do worry though, cause my brother has problems with his arm and wrist. I think both of his, his uh, wrists has, has, he has sort of a, some kind of nerve thing where he, his, uh, I don't know, something. I'm coloring everything! And, uh... Her walls. You like your new room? Oh hey breakfast, did you take care of the swamp then? Chicory, I saw something. You were there in the swamp, and you said some things that... Library thinks it's connected to you, but it wasn't real, right? Uh-oh. What have we said? She's slowly engulfing us into the darkness. <clears throat> you don't like my little mushroom outfit? Blackberry said that, huh? Guess there's no point in hiding it anymore. Chicory, what? What's going on? I'm a messed up person. That's what's going on. You're not- all these corruptions, they're not just connected to me. They're coming from inside me. I can't stop them. 
They expose all my worst thoughts and fears. Reveal awful things. But that, it's not real, right? You said that, you said there that I'm a joke and I don't deserve the brush. But that's not what you really think, right? You think I should be the wielder. You believe in me, don't you? I can't deal with this. But I don't care who the wielder is. It doesn't matter. Just leave me alone. How can you say that? I did it for you. I thought we could be friends. I can't believe I looked up to you. Chicory. I'm sorry. Just go away. That I shouldn't have... Go. Dun dun. Let's go back in there. Lock. I'm sorry. Just for that, I'm... Uh... I'm gonna put... Oh gosh, that's a big X. I'm gonna put big X's all over your house. There's nothing you can do to stop me. And then, and then I'm gonna crisscross it. Oh, we don't have, we don't have green. I can't do uh, Joker colors. Oh well. I was gonna make it look like the Joker was here. All right. Well, now what? Are, now what are we gonna do? We got a letter for, from some bugs. Is it the Bug Fable crew making a cameo appearance? What is this? Dear Wielder, the Bugs of Feast humbly re request your service. Come find us deep in the Grub Caverns on the outskirts of Dinners, the North City. It's early Queen Josera. There they go. North, huh? North of dinner. Oh no, no, I went through the fence, that's... I should look at my house- yeah, I'll do it later when I'm on the way back. Cause I know I, I got that barbecue set or whatever. And now I should be having a barbecue style home. Whoops. Oh, that's Nibble Tunnel. I think we're going that way anyway. Oh, dinners. Perfect. Well, well, when you do it with the joystick, you actually do stop at the uh, lines. There's like horse feedback. It, that's interesting. Because I don't think the mouse did that. I don't remember having force feedback on the mouse. Let me let me see. And with the joystick. Yeah, no, it literally stops you your joyce your joystick motion. Hang on, I have an idea. down here. I think so. 
I mean, I didn't even notice if the mouse d does have it. I didn't even notice. <clears throat> I guess probably because when I'm filling the screen, I'm usually moving the mouse around more quickly. Uh, I can't really mash the color change button to get rainbow because it's still in a weird- Because I have to hit R1 quickly to change it and then R2 is to draw. Oh, I guess I could do that a little bit. But the- The way it's stopping... Oh, this corner is uncolorable. Oh, no, nope, that was just my finger. I guess this is more uh, doable than with the mouse. It's still a little awkward though. This one specific cave room, it's all rainbow. We're in dinners. They have streets and crosswalks and there's our sister. Breakfast, what brings you to the big city? Busy with important wielder stuff? Guess so. Hmm. You should come get a slice with me. Where, what are we in, New York? city and are we in Brooklyn in terms of screens it's just one up from here I'll meet you inside well that's the the, mo the clearest directions I've ever gotten I was wondering if they would actually run into me As someone who's been hit by a vehicle while walking across the street in a crosswalk I think, uh... I mean, I'm, I'm... I'm glad that they stop. And that they're in bicycles. Oh, look at this guy. Little triangle man. Hey, I cannot wait to, um, hey, breakfast. You look kind of down. Oh, I guess I am. It's about chicory. Oh my gosh, no. Did she say something nasty to you? Do I have to go beat her up? Yes. My big sister has to go beat up my, uh, my teacher. I mean, she did, but you shouldn't beat her up if you say so. I guess she must be going through a lot right now, too. With everything happening, I guess, I hope she's okay. <clears throat> but I wouldn't worry about what she said. You're the sweetest, coolest little wielder there's ever been. And I'm not just saying that because I'm your sister. I love you, breakfast. That's what I say in the morning. <laughs> you know I always have your back. I would be down with a car-free city. Oh, that's a deep hug. Uh, thanks Clementine. Did you still want to have a slice with me? Pizza! Let's -a go! My god. Ah, that hit the spot. I'm surprised I haven't heard of this place before. Can't believe they ate the pizza off screen. How's wielding going anyway? been kind of a lot to be honest. Chicory's doing worse than ever, and the Bug Queen needs my help or something, and the Elevensies Gallery's missing paintings. Not to mention there's lost kids everywhere. Haha. <laughs> You're so focused on everyone else's problems. Oh, am I? Yeah, you always say yes to everything. But you know, it's okay to say no sometimes too. Things are different now that I'm wielding. You can't just let everyone down. Can't you? I'm in time. I don't think you really get it. Even Wilder's gotta take breaks, you know. You need to make time for yourself too. But how am I supposed to do that? Hey, uh, excuse me. You're the Wilder, right? Dude, we're kinda having a moment. Oh. 
Well, so like I was saying, my slice is pretty dang good, right? But I really don't know a thing about marketing. Oh, we gotta design you something? Yeah, let's do it. Are people just like that with you? Basically. No wonder you're such a little stress ball. Well, why don't you let me help you? I could scribble some stuff. And then, you just add as much or little as you feel like. That'd be fun, right? And she's actually, is like an art. She like goes to art school and stuff, so she probably... What the? This must be abstract art. Um... I'm gonna take inspiration from my last logo I designed. for this part. Can we change the size of it? I forgot how to change the size of the thing. Oh, I'll do it with the controller. I don't know what a scribble game is now. Pizza. Uh, that's it. Oh, yes, this is it. The power of your teamwork. It's created the perfect logo. That was fun, but I gotta get going now. Good luck with everything, breakfast. Uh, it's okay to say no. Love ya. Well, they didn't give me the choice to say no to this, did they? The goalie. I'm big goalie. You ever think about how slice is a weird name for something? I know it's because you eat it in slices, but... Never mind. Stevia? The heck? What's going on here? I've been the only guy going to this shop for years. Now all of a sudden they've got a logo and a huge lineup? Man, this place changed. Sold their soul to make a buck. Heh. Gotta get some slice though. When you're a hipster but you still like the food too much. Makes me think this reminds me of like Mario Odyssey, like Hello. Is that not a person? Yeah. <laughs> I guess that wasn't a person. <clears throat> Who are you? Aha, it's you, the new wielder. 
I shouldn't be muted. Muted? Hello? I've been talking. OBS says I'm not muted. That's weird. Um, about time you showed up, we need to talk about the mail. Uh, I don't know about all that. Yeah, this big fancy place. Oh, we just went straight to the rooftop. Avocado. Welcome to the rooftop party. Did you see my flyers? To be honest, I'm kind of new to throwing parties. People keep coming up here, but when they see the big empty roof, they just kind of look around awkwardly, then uh, leave. Probably should have thought about decoration or furniture. Lesson learned. Uh, if you have any of that stuff, you should totally throw it down here. I don't have furniture. But... I can decorate. And then I can be like... Now this just looks like a love roof. The love roof. Oops. Um. Oh, I thought the camping set was for my place, though. Darn, I wanted to grill burgers. Okay, well. I guess he needs it more than I do. How do I do it? Uh... Oh, so it doesn't just automatically drop everything. There's a bunch of different things. Okay. Here, you can grill. You have a bench. You have an umbrella for the people sitting at the bench. Whoops. I just wanted that to be on top of the umbrella. Okay, um, a stump. Uh,. How do I go lower? Another barbecue. Here. Cooler. Stump. Uh. Okay, I think that's good. I don't think there should be a tent up here. Oh, a record player. Oh, I don't have that. You could lay there, buddy. Alright, that ought to work, right? Oh heck yeah, this is it. The party's saved. You did me a huge solid. I bet loads of people show up soon. Maybe check back in a bit. Alright buddy. I got you. Where's Bu Bugtown? It was up north from here, right? What is that crossing thing? It's like a bird head but human legs. Technically, I guess all the animals here are like that. An adult. Wait a minute. They have four sets of legs. Ahem. Hello, fellow adult. I'm in line to get my transit pass. Go on, cool adult adventures. Which aren't even that cool. Because I go on them all the time. Uh, as an adult. Taxes, accounting, mowing lawns, vegetables. These are... These are a few of my favorite things. Have you seen the latest adult rated film? I'm sure- I sure have. I've seen them all. Even the ones with lots of... Hissing. 
Not kissing. Good day to you. This is the Transit Pass Agency. If you're a citizen of age, you're entitled to a free transit pass here. Whoa, free transit pass? Heck yeah. I could change my name. No, we gotta be for breakfast. What's your birth month? Well, that's a little personal, but... What day of the month is your... Uh, for your birthday. Wait, what the heck? So you could either have specifically 29th, 33rd, or you have these ranges, or is that just, um, subcategories? Okay, I see. There we go. Now everybody knows. Maybe I should get dressed up good for this picture. Let's see. Uh, boy, the menus do not feel good on the control. I don't even know how to switch between these hats. There we go. Let's see. Uh, uh, okay, see, that's... Wow. Hang on. Never mind. Okay, so um that's me. Wait. If I hit L2 it goes to the right, but if I hit R2 it also goes to the right. That's really weird. He's kinda cool. A sleeveless hoodie? That's silly. I'll wear this. Alright, I'm ready. I'm gonna take your photo. Please maintain a neutral expression and pose. Was that a Mario and Luigi Superstar Saga reference? Sign on the bottom here. Please refrain from marking other areas. Oh gosh, I am bad at doing a signature normally. Uh. Oh no! We're in star mode. I don't even know the cursive for a uh, uppercase. Oh, damn it. Can you turn it off or it doesn't? I, when I'm holding the button down to let go slowly, it thinks I want to start doing a splotch in a situation where you don't want to do a splotch. I don't want to do a K either. Oh, well. I'll just have to do it. Alright, let me see my card. Does that look like almost cursive? I was so bad at cursive as a kid. They tried to make me learn it so bad too. They kept giving me these sheets to take home to practice cursive and it just didn't stick with me. Oh, you have a transit pass? Can we, um, can I have it? I think that's illegal. You're not me. Um... So can I have your transit pass? No. It has my name and face on it and my signature. I'm not getting in trouble. 
Why are you reading that? Huh? I'm waiting for transit. Sure, but why are you reading that? It's not that bad. It's interesting political theory. Have you read it? I have. It's garbage. Gosh, you, uh... You get a haircut here. Look, sword, I'm not gonna commit a felony, okay? Mochi. Well, sure. Can I take my hat off? Uh, medium, I guess. Even though I have long hair. Give me a cool haircut. That doesn't matter. He gave me a cow lick. I don't even remember what my old hair looked like. Sure, that's fine. We used to have a partner who did some really crazy stuff with hair. We started the shop together. Ain't seen him in a long, long time though. Tried to write them once, but I don't think the letter ever made it. Hope they're doing okay out there. <clears throat> don't know where that came from. Have a nice day. Thought it was usually the person getting their hair done that set like reveals a lot of information to the hairdresser. Okay, I'm like spending a lot of time in this town. I need to like uh, start making some progress here. Oh, that's the flyer for the rooftop party. And there's a scared skunk named Pepper. Uh, have you seen a little skunk around? Oh, now I'm gonna have to start looking for skunks. I have, a, I have like 10 extra kittens. Do you want one of those? I found some lost kids, but no skunk, sorry. Can't believe I let this happen. I stitched our address into his, his kerchief? Is that just a shortened version of handkerchief? Handkerchief? Look, I will take, I will play it safe, and I don't think I'm going to give that potentially an adult. Grub Caverns, that's where we need to go. What's up here, though? A litter-free province. That's my dream for picnic. Oh, you're the trash guy. For it to come true, we gotta pick it all up. I'm trying to do my part, but there's so much. Right now, the place you've been with the most litter would be dinners. Six... Litter on six screens. But don't you want all the trash that I picked up already? Yeah, I'm pretty sure we're supposed to go this way. I don't remember how to change the dang size of my brush on mouse. Wait. It's X. Okay. Wait, that's Grub Caverns? Why is it blocked off? Yeah, you just can't beat the mouse. Trash. The 
The spacebar isn't set to anything, is it? Um, I'm gonna set the spacebar to jump, actually. I think that'll... Oh yeah, that feels way better. I mean, if you're using Wasad, space to jump is just natural. I mean, I feel like we're doing enough side stuff uh, already. Just kind of on our way to places. Um... If I spend any more time on them, they probably would uh, start to become a bit of a time sink. I know there's 10 chapters and we only did three that first stream. Bell. What is this? Breaking Bad? What am I? Hector Salamanca? And I wear it on my head? It's like I always dreamed of. Sent to feast, shortcut to surface, bugs only. What does that mean? Oh, I know we want to go to feast. Rub deep. Ah, oh, watch out. Phew, you almost stepped on me. I'm Prunus, the royal bug ambassador. Uh... I can't see you, Prunus. I've been waiting to take you to the queen. Queen Drosra, ruler of all insects. She's well. She's not accustomed to outsiders. But this matter is serious, so you'll need to beat her. I say he's deep. Uh, deep down at the heart of these caverns, the path might be tough for a non-bug like you. Well, I'll see you down there. Pronus a flea? Was that his name Pronus? Whoa. Look at that. They go to where you paint. What the heck? That's Skinny Pete's hat? Are these all the clues in this area? Just Breaking Bad references? We got a bell, we got Skinny Pete's hat. Oh, that was not a hat. I thought that was a beanie. They tricked me. That's a tough jump. Unless that's like a little too high up. Looks like we're about to land on it and then we... Hmm. Maybe I should use this. Oh, but I can't...
Maybe if I move you here. Oops. Get out the way. No. There we go. There we go. I got a nice shirt even. I think I need you here. A little finicky. Oh, but I couldn't land on that. Whoops. Messed up. Careful, it must be hard for you to see in this dark. Well, good news, the city's just ahead. I hope I didn't scare you too much about Queen Drosera. She's a massive ancient beast of the darkness, but also a total sweetheart. I'm sure you'll be fine. Is she gonna be the boss fight? Come along now. Oh, I thought that was a path upwards. Not bad. Oh, drat. The weight of the city is just down from here, but these rocks have fallen in the way. What an inconvenience. Well, not for me. I could crawl around them easily. Life's hard for a non-bug, isn't it? As an ambassador, I've learned a lot about cultural sensitivity. I suppose you'll need to find a way through. Don't worry, I'll wait patiently for you. Um... Oh, I, I can see what I'm... Question is, how do I get you to those rocks? Huh. If there was one of those things in here... Oh, there is one of those things in here. Who's hiding? Cleverly hiding looking identical to all the other ones. Yeah, all these rooms had a bunch of rocks that were similar looking, so they blended right in. Almost close enough to blow that up. Looks like trash I should pick up. 
dough I missed. There we go. Maybe I just need to go to that other pine. I haven't been down here yet, have I? A big present. It's a 100 star present! Did they ever have that in the later Mario parties? Where Bowser spun his 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 wheel and you could land on 100 stars. It seemed like it was impossible to land on, but you could land on it, and then he just he just runs away. have it in the new one that's a remake of the old ones. Come over here. I feel like I'm missing something. Because how would I even get on top of these guys? Oh, can this fling me on top of it? There we go. Okay, so right here, that's where he... <laughs> From this, you'd think it'd be going up higher, but I guess not. No! I was trying to open the present. Darn it. I think I made it. Yeah, the only thing about having to jump on space is that I think space is also the interact button. Okay. There we go. The heck? That's like a right angle. This whole area was just for that, wasn't it? That means I'm still a bit stuck. See if I can find those launching flowers. No launching flowers up here. No 
matching flowers up here. More rocks so they can't blow up. get to this one well the, f the funny thing is that on the other side it's more rocks <laughs> okay so out of the way. okay so we can't blow the this rock up we can't blow these rocks up Can't blow these rocks up. In here we have Oh. There we go. Wait, is that there we go? That might not be a there we go. No, see, I can't reach that vine still. Can I make you, like, go off the cliff? Possible? No. Oh, I think I know what to do. I think we need to use these two. Oh, no, but then how do I get on top of this one? Yeah, there's no point of having this here if I can't get on this one to begin with. Unless this is supposed to be higher up than this and then I'd be able to jump from here. It's hard to tell from the depth. Okay, I didn't realize that ledge was higher up like that. I don't know what my favorite pasta is, to be honest. I like pasta a lot, but I don't really have like a... I don't know if I like prefer a specific noodle. I usually think more like I don't even know. Well what the heck? Can I use this to push it? Well not really because when I put the paint on it 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 blows up. There we go. No! Oh man, this is gonna be so freaking tricky. Cause you need to put the- Okay, it spawned in the right spot. I think the game felt bad for me. Cause you need to do the trail for him to eat, but then when you touch the ball with the gunk, that also blows it up. Okay, and then... I put you up here. to jump on top of that first. Just walk on top of that. There we go. I'm on the wrong side as the ball though. There we go.
Now we can blow this stuff up. But hang on, before we go down there, this is probably an optional. Oh, this is a, a super simple one, ain't it? Finding a place to put that. I have a tuxedo. I just got an achievement, probably for getting a certain amount of clothes. Just clothing curious. Spike helmet. What are we, a skateboarder? From the 90s. Oh boy. Have you ever tried a skateboard? Yeah. I never got too far. I could like stand on the skateboard while it was moving. That's basically it. I couldn't even like turn. And then while I was learning, not literally while I was like on a skateboard, but that's like, I got hit by a car when I was crossing the street. When I was, I was like in middle school. And I couldn't, I couldn't skateboard at that point. So I never got much. I don't think I would have got any farther, anyways. The the balancing was uh. Now how the heck am I supposed to blow up? Ah, okay, I see. Um, the car that hit me got impounded. The card lost, so I, I can I can at least say that I beat the car. I mean I damaged it up pretty bad because I hit the front of the, I like destroyed the front windshield. I feel like this is the most involved cave so far. Where am I? <laughs> I can't even see myself. Oh, I'm up here. We should make cars illegal. I'd be down. I, I, I was always, that's the worst part. I was always nervous about crossing the street even before that car hit me. 
And another time when I was in elementary school, I almost got hit by a car when I was crossing the, the street on a crosswalk. At the time, my school was right across the street from where I used to live. So all I had to do was just cross this you know, street and I would walk down a, a little bit and then I was at the school. It wasn't literally right across the street, but I just had to cross the street and then walk like one way down the sidewalk a bit. Um, and yeah, I remember that car, a car just almost hit me and I like had to like dive out of the way. And I like got all scraped up and I was like walking to school all like, uh. I don't know why I didn't turn around and go home. I think I thought I was gonna get in trouble or something. But I just like, I just like limped to school. Ouch. I think that vine's right there. Yeah, that's why I wouldn't mind living in a place where it's like a public transport society. Even those places have cars, but just the fact that you can get around like way easier without one. Pretty convenient. Oh look, we finally made it all the way around. Feast this way, I could go for a feast. You finally made it, well done. It's just a bit further now, I can't wait. Oh man, we're already over an hour in on this chapter. I hope that the cave was like the main puzzle part of this. It's just gonna be this tiny little place, isn't it? The colors changed. This is it, the entrance to feast. You'll be the first wielder to visit in decades. What a huge, exciting moment. I hope this isn't rude, but you don't look very excited. You seem a bit sad. Oh. Well, I guess I am. Oh. Sorry, I've just been thinking about a fight I had with a friend. Oh, I see. Um, to be honest, I'm starting to feel like I shouldn't even be the wielder. Oh. Hickory is an amazingly talented artist, and I'm nobody. I don't think I belong here. Well, I understand how you feel. You do? It's really tough being the Royal Bug Ambassador. I've learned so much about non-bug cultures, just speaking your language is really tough for a bug like me. You barely have an accent. Thank you. All my life my skills have been totally useless. Actually, they make me different from everyone. I don't feel like I belong here either. You're the first non-bug I've ever met. Oh, wow. Sorry, I must be disappointing. No, no, you're lovely. I think you're doing a good job. You came when we needed you, that's what really matters. Um, and for once I don't feel useless, so thank you very much. Anyways, let's go meet Queen Dro Drosera. Well, that, that was a nice little interaction. What the heck, Feast just looks like the rest of the cave. They tricked me. Uh-oh. I do a jump when I talk. They speak in tornadoes in this town. Hello, are you the queen? I can't understand your accent. Whoa. Are we gonna lear learn the bug language eventually? Is this like Wind Waker where on your second playthrough you'll understand the ancient god language? Okay, this is Queen Drosera's lair. I've spoken to the guard so you can enter. Um, just one thing. You can't speak bug, can you? No? That's okay. Give me just a moment. 
Ah, uh, that tickles. Yes, I'm here and I'm on your head now. I'll help you to understand Queen Drosera's wretched utterances. That's not, not a nice thing to say about your queen. He's gonna act like a babble fish in my ear. Go on then. That means I can go talk to those bugs now. How's this for um, side content? Oh, never mind. He's not translating the peasantry. Uh oh. It was an accident, I swear. Surface dweller. How dare you enter our chamber? Looking so darn cute. Oh, we can't stand it. We swear each wielder gets cuter than the last. You see, I warned you. Her wretched utterances. She's so embarrassing. Oh, hush, Prunus. So you'll help us, won't you? We don't know why or where they've come from. But we're besieged by black roots from above. They're cramping for us in our hole here, and they're scaring our citizens too. Our pass packed with the wielders means you owe us assistance. Okay, I'll see what I can do. Hmm, you don't speak bug, we suppose. That may be tricky. Brunus, would you be a deer and live on this one's head? Of course, it would be my pleasure. They're just gonna live with us forever? Won't that be awkward? Oh, no, no, it's a dream come true. I'll get to learn so much about the surface world. Don't worry, I'll be completely out of your way. I can keep your ears clean, too. Uh... Okay. Well, sure, I guess. We wish we could live with an adorable surface dweller, too. Well, the main tango roots is south of the feast. Our guards will let you through to see it. Best of luck to you, little wielder. So glad to meet another wielder. They come only so rarely. And truthfully, the last one we met wasn't nearly so cute. We've been about for a long, 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 long time. The you little wielder seem to come and go so quickly. So sad, we always miss them. We used to live on the surface once, so long ago now. We were much smaller then. Things were easy. I like how she speaks in the, the royal we. We remember the sun so hot and bright. We remember that first wielder and their delightful colors. Ah, precious memories. I want to give each one of your segments a different... Oops. Uh-oh. Stop moving. Oh, you're new. Wallenbergia. Did you and the queen have a nice chat? She's really something else, right? It's very rare we get to speak with her, so don't take it for granted. You look like a crescent mood rhinoceros beetle or something. Wow, they even have a phone down here. Past here is dangerous, I'm supposed to keep folks out, but the queen says you're okay, so you're okay. Go on ahead. Have a nice day. Prinum. What are the bugs named after? Are they like... I haven't even seen the growth much myself. I did take a peek, but boy it's scary. Wouldn't want to be the one going in there. Heard about your black trees, never seen them grow down this deep though. Something wild must be going on up there, hey? There it is. The tree. 
Whoa. Whoa, this one's got like a... a mirrored effect. Obscured scientific names. Okay, I was thinking it had to be some kind of food, but just different. Uh oh, breakfast. It is I, your your dark other half brunch. I had a feeling it was going to be something other than chicory this time. Huh? Give it up already. What do you think you're doing here? I, I'm not scared of you, but I am you. I know everything there is to know about you. Look at you playing the wielder. You really think you should be the one holding that brush? Well, no, but I'm doing my best. Chicory trusted me with it. Chicory? After what she said, you think she trusts you? No, she probably hates me. Of course she does. You're completely alone and embarrassing yourself. It's time we put an end to it. Uh oh. Okay, so now you want to do the opposite. Jumping over these, I don't think I even realized. Chilled down already. Gosh darn it. Finally. Oh jeez. Sure, putting up a fight, me. What a waste of time. I'm not going anywhere. The Black Forest will swallow everything, and it'll all be your fault. We did it. We did chapter four. We gotta at least do another chapter. Yeah, that was a that was an interesting change of pace with the boss. Interesting how you drop the brush every time. I can swim up vertical surfaces. Oh, see, I was trying to do that since, like, ever since I got the ability. 
That seemed like natural. That would happen eventually. Does that not count as a vertical surface? Um, excuse me, did you take care of that black tangle? Yep. Okay, because it would appear that in fact, nothing has actually changed or improved. Well, thanks for your help. You might want to talk to the queen before you leave. Queen, 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 queen. Queen, queen, queen. Queen. Hello. Yeah, maybe I could fix you now. See, it's like it, the hit detection is wonky. If I zoom in, what are you zooming in again? Let's try this one. Detection here is so weird. With specifically with the red da, da, da. No, this wants to be green. There we go. And this the one behind it. How do you zoom in? Let's go. Plus, okay. This one's red. Okay, I give up. Taking a look at those roots yet? Sure did. Sure did. <laughs> We're traumatized. But they haven't gone away. No. Come to think of it, whenever I go into one of those spooky trees, they never actually go away. They just close up. Ah. Then it seems you must find the true source of all the roots. The growths here are vicious, but they are only a symptom of the larger problem above us. That must be the only way to make them go away. The true source of the roots. But where could that be? How are we supposed to know, darling? But surely somewhere in the surface world, we are counting on you. Okay. We're like pushing her back in. Oh, jeez. Wish she reacts to you, uh... Oh my, what a lovely little creature. How do you like my antenna? Antennae. And my sleek little skin dots, aren't they lovely? They must be overwhelmingly pretty for a foreigner like you. Funny how you cover yourself with those little cloths. Without those, you must be very ugly, I guess? Or does it help you hide from predators? I wonder so much about your funny surface culture. I love the little sounds you make. Oh, you're just so strange and lovely. This is a short- Yep, I was hoping. Uh, for bugs, I mean. I assume you can't climb up walls like us. Sometimes I'm jealous of the littler bugs. They can discreetly come and go to the surface world. There's no way I'm sneaking out there. I mean, here's better anyway. Sometimes I wonder. Bugs only, huh? Check this out. For some reason my... drawing was... Okay. <laughs> Whoa! I'm glad he reacted to that. Bugs. 
Oh, there's litter right there. Also, a little path to the left. Oh, that must be a quick travel, uh, bench. Use that later. It looks like over here they're already going to be another tree. What? Something's going on. Ah, hey breakfast. I've been looking everywhere for you. Um, the Wilder Tower and Luncheon. It's uh, something spook spooky is happening there. I mean, I guess it's not a rush, but like, you should maybe check that out. If you get a minute. Okay. I'm going uh, back home now. Okay. Um, is that a bear trap? Well, there's a bench shortcut right over here, so that should probably be the fastest way to lunch, and I would assume. There we go, luncheon. They did say it was in luncheon, right? Oh! Okay, I wasn't expecting that. Let's go see how Chicory's doing. Oh yeah, I forgot I left X's everywhere. Chicory, can you hear me? Are you okay? I mean, I know you're probably not. Chicory, something horrible is going on. The black forest is spreading everywhere. And it's starting to look and talk like me, too. It isn't safe here anymore. Please, you have to come out. Chicory? Are you... Oh. The door's open. Oh, the door's open. Whoa! Look, the color just gets eaten up right away. The room's bigger than I remember. Oh, look, it's the drawing I made. Ugh. The rabbit chicory. Sorry, the, the mouse chicory. It's the painting I did of chicory. I didn't think she'd really hang it up. There she is. She looks fine. Nothing's wrong here. You came back. Chicory, you need to get out of this tower. It's not safe anymore. Something horrible is happening here. I'm what's happening here. I told you. No, you're, you're, link, you're leaking, uh, like, orange drink. All of this came from me. I'm just a broken, messed up person. You can't save me from this. The sooner you abandon me, the better off you'll be. Chicory, I... None of that's true. The last time I saw the darkness, it... Why won't you listen to me? Uh, it's all my fault. It's all my fault. It's all my fault. Uh-oh. Holy crap, another boss fight already? Jesus! Chicory, please listen. This darkness isn't just you. It started looking and speaking like me too. It must be something else. Then why did it all come out when I had the brush? Why did all the color vanish? You think you did that? No, but stop making excuses for me. My entire reign as Wilder was a mistake. The only good thing I ever did was pass it on to you. 
Please forget about me. I'll just make everything worse. No! Uh-oh. Oh gosh. Don't Pac-Man me. Oh gosh. Chicory, you. You really think I'm a better wielder than you? Of course you are. But when I saw that part of you in the swamp, you said you regretted giving the brush to me. I regret a lot of things. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. I don't know why I'd say something so stupid. Just another mistake. Nothing good comes from me. Why would you even want me around? This is intense. Oh gosh. yourself. Chicory, just go. You're better off without me. All these problems came from me. I don't care where they came from. I can't face it all alone anymore. I need your help. I won't abandon you. So stop asking me to. Please. I'm not going anywhere. I'm here. Just breathe. I can't abandon you. The game is, is named after you, for goodness sake. You... You've seen yourself in there too? Yeah. It spoke like it was me. And said stuff I was thinking, so something came from me. But if it came from you, and from me too, then it's from something common between us. It must have been... The brush. Yep. The brush. When I was wielding the brush, it's like it was connected to me. The more my bond with it grew, the more I could do with it and shape and color reality. But, I wonder if it made more things real than just that. Breakfast. I'm so, so sorry for whatever you heard in the swamp. That's not who I want to be. When those corruptions talk to me, it's like all my self-doubts come to life, reminding me of every mistake I've made. Chikri, you're so much more than that. It hurts to hear you talk about yourself that way. I forgive you. I just wish I could help. Well, more than that. I want to be your friend. I thought by now you hated me. I thought you hated me. I'm so sorry. I just dropped you into this giant mess. I need to be better. I'm going to try. But I need you to wilt the brush. Nope. The end. Oh wow, chapter 5 was fast. Chapter 6 was over- sorry, chapter 4 was over an hour. And chapter 5 was like 20 minutes or something, so... I guess- I, I was thinking we were only gonna get to do two chapters tonight, but I- Hopefully... Okay, yeah, I guess like, we're gonna do chapter 6 then as well. Did it just say your bond with the brush, but did it, didn't it say that it leveled up? I can paint and swim on water. Center of all corruption and picnic is at the top of this tower. 
You can see for yourself if you swim up there, but you aren't ready to face it yet because you haven't become a proper wielder yet. I haven't? That's my fault. There's a series of five wielder trials. Well, one was the wielder temple, which you did. So four wielder trials, one at each corner of picnic. That's how you're meant to bond with the brush. And that's how you could reach the, your, that last step. From now on, I'm gonna be your teacher. I can't promise I'll be perfect, but I'm at least gonna try. Okay. Uh, what are the trials? Each trial explores a different aspect of being the wielder. We'll find one at each corner of picnic. Aim will be to commune with the brush in different ways, so your bond with it is as strong as can be, okay? Bonding with the brush seems bad. I do think my bond with the brush somehow made the corruptions, and your bond too, but everyone's in danger now from those corruptions, and we can't fight them without bonding with the brush. So right now we don't have a choice about it. Decide what to do with the brush. Where do I find them? Each trial is at one of the furthest reaches of Picnic. Explore out there and you'll find them. Use your map. Or if you're really in a pinch, you can always call for help at a phone booth. I like how she knows I can call my parents. Alright. You look nervous. Oh, uh, I'm not. It's okay if you are. I was too. And I was under a lot less pressure. I can do it. I want to be stronger. I want to learn how to be a, wield a real wielder and help everyone and help you too. I can do it. Okay. Come find me at one of the trials. You could do it breakfast. Alright, so we need to go to one of the four corners. Uh, a, is Picnic just the name of the world? So I need to go to like any four corner, huh? The game world is Picnic Province. That makes it sound more like a country. Or a province, I guess. Okay, I need to find a- Oh no, what happened? Did I erase everything? Oh no. But I erased everything. Oh, someone's calling already. Hello? Hi breakfast, it's your mom. Are you doing okay? I know it's out of the blue, but I was thinking of coming to visit at your house and luncheon. Hi, Wilder Tower. Thought I'd give you a heads up because, well, when you moved in, I don't think you should be visiting right now, Mom. Things aren't going so good here. Maybe you try to make it look presentable, you know? That's all. I'll see you at your house sometime. Take some time to decorate if you haven't already. I'm excited to see you there. Uh, you're going to be disappointed, Mother. My, my home is quite barren. I need to find a park bench. I don't know where those... Oh, here's one. Uh... There's a corner. Oh. Um... This is pretty close to the corner. also a dead end though. Ah, up here maybe. Whoa. 
Oh, there's these rocks are in the way. Burn it. Are you sure we could choose any order? It doesn't look like this path is open yet. Because it looks like we would have to destroy the rocks from the other side. And we know we can't go around the right because that's blocked off. Doesn't seem to be an opening from the left either. Where's that bus stop at? Did I jump off the cliff and now I can't get back to it, huh? Oh, wait. Wait, I could go up here. Oh, right, okay. That's a dead end. Why don't we try over here then? Ah, perfect. A big drink. How to do the trick? would lit litter on a beach like this? Oh, look, chicory! Hey, breakfast. Looks like you found your first trial. Because I knew I'd take someone through this someday, but my memory of being on the other side is still fresh. I'll do my best, okay? The theme of this trial is finding your path as a wielder or something like that. Locating this place is just the first step. A lot of old wielder stuff here. You'll have to find your way to the heart of the island. And well, I'll leave the rest to you. Be up ahead. She doesn't have the brush, so she must have just swam here. All on her own. This spot's all blurry.
I didn't see any dots or whatever you're talking about. Sunny T. Sunny D. Whoops. Oh, you can actually swim. Look. That's what the blurry spots are for, I'm guessing. Ah, I'm trying to get that trash, but uh. Oh, there we go. Let's have to swim up the side. No, I know the big waves mean the edge of the map. Just looking around. I'll see you up ahead, but I don't know where that up ahead means exactly. There must be a part where there's like trial. Okay, not that way. More trash. Wow, a lot of trash. You say the screen with the dots, but I don't know what dots you're talking about. I didn't see any dots. Another island. There's so much trash on these islands. You go left. Huh. I guess that's just a dead zone. Achievement unlocked explorer. Dots are small circles like the ones you colored in to interact with the world in previous areas. Oh, jeez, I clicked off the game. Uh, okay. <laughs> There's a couple dots. Oh, 
I don't know. I guess I didn't see the other ones. At least this island has a phone booth. Is that a red herring? It looks like a lever. But you never use levers in this game. Plants look like little people right there. Um, I think I mean I mean if there were dots over there, the, the big rectangle spots might have been distracting me. Um, on these.
sorry, I had an unexpected person show up and they were just kind of yapping. That's why I was muted the whole time. At least I figured this out while I was distracted. But also, hey J Dub, sorry I didn't uh let's see how you these levers really are red herrings, they just sit there, don't they? Pretend to exist. they're not doing anything. Seemingly, I don't know. It doesn't seem like they're doing anything. I'm telling so I think it would make the blocks move but I can't So they're not lined up a certain way. They are, but it's just... Okay, so I don't want this. one can be up. The other ones I want down. On this side, we want those two blocks down there to be up. Oh, that's a reset switch, so it does do something, I just... Okay. It had to be ready to, to be reset, I guess. Whoops. Okay, and then here we want to then put these up. Right, and then since this one's up, I could get this trash. Okay. I don't, I don't think the music's calming, it's more like, uh, pensive. Well, it's very pensive music. Oh, they're not even letting me try to color it in yet. They don't want you to cheat. Didn't I do this already?
Dude. Ah, okay. I loved Celeste's uh, main story playthrough. I hated the epilogue. <laughs> Not that I hated the story, I just hated the... Uh, the gameplay. Because it went from like... Oh, this is a game with very, very simple gameplay but just very challenging which is generally like up my alley to now you need to learn how to do speedrun moves just to like attempt to try to do these rooms and i was like oh okay well there goes my fun uh i could make it purple if you want Yep. Yeah, depending on what area you're in, you'll get four different colors. Sometimes I feel like there's like three colors, rarely, but I think it's usually four. I think this is an interesting puzzle. I like that each chapter kind of has a different, um, puzzle mechanic going on. That's it. Okay, and then there's one more in the top left. Yeah, right here there's this color. And then, um... Like a... Turquoise or something. question is, how do I get up there? I'm up this, but the rocks are in the way.
Oh, can you only swim on the white spots? Because then in that case... I was never really quite sure which spots you were allowed to swim on. Okay, I think I... Now I get it. present while I'm here, actually. Possible. Uh -oh. oh! Okay. This ought to be a good gift. Ahoy! It's a pirate hat. Sure, let's wear it. I'm a pirate now on an island. Oh, there's a castle there too. I, I went to Matsumoto. Was it Matsumoto? I think so. Uh, castle, which was a really awesome experience. It was during the weekday, so it was like... The only people there, it was a bunch of, like, grandparents with their grandkids. That was, like, everyone else <laughs> there. Hey, Blaze. The aquarium's, uh, always fun. Alright, anyways, let's... Connect these dots here. Okay, we need this one or else it ain't going anywhere. And that can go up here. Here. Oh, there we go. That looks right. There we go. Who are we plundering now? We plunder in something, all right. Wonder where that leads to. Oh, there she is. Breakfast. It's a great view, isn't it? Is this the end? Almost. You've got one final thing to do here. This place is where every wilder paints their self-portrait. The one that hangs in the wilder tower. Oh, what the heck? So when you feel ready, go to that canvas and paint yourself. This is the moment you'll capture forever. Where you're no longer just you, but a true wielder. Try not to be nervous, haha. <laughs> oh boy. I'm not ready for this. I'm ready to move on. Wait, wait, wait. That suggests that there's something here that we're gonna leave if I don't... I don't know. I'm just gonna... Um... This... Oh... <laughs> oh gosh. I'm not even gonna try to draw breakfast. I'm just gonna, um...
I can't do a body. I'll just do a shirt. I'm just, whoops. I don't have a body, I just have a shirt. <laughs> I just have a shirt that's too big for me for some reason. Uh, it's not yellow, I was gonna put a sun up there. So, that's always easy to add. myself a pattern on my shirt, is that possible? We did the chapter. We actually. I uh, tell you what. Um, I don't think I'm gonna do a whole another chapter tonight, but I'll I'll do a, a couple side things. Uh, since we've we were able to do those chapters pretty good time, and then that would leave just four chapters left, right? Which would mean I would have. Should have plenty of time to finish it up in like two more streams. I think now's a good stopping point. I'm gonna do just a couple of side things, I think, just because I don't know. Because I'm gonna want to, um. Probably focus as much on the chapters as I can next time. Um. I nice job, breakfast. I'll take your portrait back to the Wilder Tower. I'm excited to see how it looks with the others. But anyways, congratulations breakfast, you just finished your first wilder trial, that's a huge first step. I'm glad I got through it too. Well, I don't know about you, but I'm feeling a lot more confident to tackle the other three, at the other corners of the picnic. I'll be waiting at the next one. Achievement unlocked. Two chapters and some side stuff for each one. See, I mean, I was able to do this uh, mission surprisingly quickly, which is cool. I was worried because that first chapter took me over an hour. Spooky trees are a curiosity. Yeah, they up and sprouted when all the color vanished. They go so deep, can't find the bottom of them. Felt haunted, so I tossed it. I should have taken a bet. Um, oh, there's one right there. Alright, well, how about we go to the town and do a couple things there? Because, uh. Not the town, the big city, I mean. Well, they asked me what my favorite food was. And, and you know how hard it is to pick a favorite food? 
Can you think of a sing single favorite food? So I just thought of like one of my favorite food genres, which is breakfast. Wow, look at this party going on. Look, it's a party. Woo. Here, you can have this. Ooh, a couch. It's my couch. Well, it was. Now it's yours. May the party go on forevermore. Yeah, party. You know I'm always going to be where the party's at. You got to get some music going here, though. Ain't a party with some tunes blasting. I'll let you figure that out. Ooh, a party. Check it out. It's my party wiggle. My special attack. I'm going to use it to try to attract friends. I don't think I met you. Glad there was a party going on. Needed a break for my job. I run the plan exchange at the other end of the dinners. Check it out sometime. Really committed to it. It's an important cause. There's a unicycle bird to talk to. I like coming out to dinners. Potluck is so quiet. It's good for focusing on art, but after a while I feel like I'm going crazy. I need noise and action, or else it feels like I'm not alive. Well, we got it. We sure have a party going on here, don't we? Oh, the crow. Oh, the, they are on a unicycle. What's wrong with new ideas? Nothing at all. You can't just dismiss it, it addresses actual issues. Like, there's plenty that works right now, don't get me wrong. Shared worker profits, functional, government-controlled property, all that. But it sucks if you want to start your own business. Fairness is great, but all that red tape also prevents innovation. Sure, I agree. So, shouldn't we do something to improve it? I think we should abolish money altogether. What the heck? Don't tell me you're one of those. How do you imagine society functioning without money? You gonna barter for every slice you order? No. You create a shared storehouse of all goods and products. Everyone contributes to that storehouse to the extent of their ability and takes to the extent of their need. Wow, it sounds real simple. It is. What if someone decides to steal it all for themselves? Then they pit themselves against all of society. They wouldn't win. What if someone burns down the storehouse? You wouldn't actually keep it all in just one place. We can deflect and theorize all day. I'm just saying it would work. There's a lot of things to figure out, but all systems of government have things to figure out. This is like, getting really political. We never did talk to the mail guy. Uh, what's up with the mail? What's up with the mail? It's going nowhere, that's what's up. My work hasn't shown up since the color wipe. Someone needs to deliver it, and that someone's you. Oh, I me. Because you're a public servant. And you travel around anyway. And it was your color wiping that got us into this mess. But, no buts. Now take this. Mail bag. And a letter to deliver. Dress two screens right from the dinner's transit bench. Uh, you could check it anytime on your collection screen. Come back after it's delivered. Okay. So there's a mail delivering side thing like, um, in Paper Mario. I'm telling you that the little pedestrian walking bird with legs looks so familiar. Everyone rides a bike here. It's like in Singapore actually, like a lot of people are riding bikes around in, in uh, some of the popular areas. It's actually a little annoying. <laughs> but I think it's better than... Well, they have cars there too. They just have public transport so you don't need to be in a car. Alright, do you really want me to give this kid my, my, my pass? Because Sword is trying to get me to break the law and give this kid a tran- my, my transit pass with my picture, my name on it, my signature on it. So if I get in trouble, it's Sword's fault. Okay. Um. I 
I have a mustache, but now I can't. How am I supposed to travel now? I don't have a f I don't have quick travel anymore. Did you illegally give your transit pass to those children? Not my problem. Would you like a transit pass? I need to get another one now. What the heck? I have to do this all over again? how I actually take pictures. I did a good deed. Oh great. Wait, what the heck? What happened to my picture? Look at I'm all squished. Oh man, my last picture was perfect. Look what you did to me. They don't have black ink to choose from this time. I don't know how that happened. Oop. I'm trying to make the thing smaller. It's not letting me make- there we go. You haven't seen that before, well... Uh, yeah. Oh my god, this is- hang on. as small as this thing can get. It is, yeah, okay. Or maybe if I zoom in. There we go. I feel like it's coming out thicker than before. I'm having trouble. Yeah, I don't remember it coming out this thick. You know what? I'm just gonna go by my given name there. I mean, I have a horrible signature in real life too, but I could at least try to make it legible. Is there anything else I should do before I, uh... What are you scared about? Oh, your kid's missing, right? Oh, a letter for you! Yeah, so thank goodness, yeah, somebody named Beans has my lost son. I was deathly worried. I'm so glad he's safe. All the way in luncheon. How did he wander off so far, poor thing? I've gotta head to luncheon right away. Thank you so much. I hope I'll see you again sometime. And, um, Paper Mario, it's funny because you find lost letters all over the place. And you have- the mailman joins your party. Paracarry is the mailman. <laughs> so that's why you end up, uh, delivering letters. Because it's, like, his duty. And then you could go to the mail station and, like, uh... Read mail that each party member gets. I love Paper Mario. The first one is still my favorite. I got- I'm gonna- I gotta stream that at some point. I've just been saving it. For a good moment. So did you deliver the letter? Yeah. It was someone like right outside. Are you sure you need me to deliver these for you? Absolutely yes. This time I've got a whole stack for you to deliver. A bunch of letters. First one's addressed to the middle of three square houses in a row. If you want to deliver a different one, sort it in your collection screen. Okay. Best side quest is in Simmer Spring, so make sure to explore the area once you get there. Yeah, I don't think I've been there yet. Um... Oh look, it's... Yeah, I'm here to get my slice on. I always knew this place was great. Nice to see them getting more traffic now. Boy, there's nothing like a perfect slice. I'll go anywhere they say is good. I'll go anywhere they say is bad, too. I just really like me some slice. It's really hard to make bad pizza. Like... There's definitely pizza that's better than other pizza, or worse than other pizza, but like... It's hard to screw a pizza so bad that you, 
but you can't eat it. All right, J-Dub, thanks for dropping in. I appreciate it. I'm probably going to wrap up soon anyways. I just wanted to do maybe like one more side thing. Oh man, do you know Chicory? That's so wicked. I'm a big, big fan. Her colors made the world feel so alive and magical. You could feel her spirit bursting out of every stroke. She must be so cool in person. Back to want some slice too. The city of Altoona, Pennsylvania managed somehow. Altoona style pizza is cursed. I'll have to look. Uh, I'll have to look up Altoona style pizza at some point. I want to talk to you. How do I get back there? Ah, I see. Back, something went wrong with my transit pass ID picture. Why are there like vampire teeth just laying on the ground? Hey, the name's Stevia. You probably saw me and thought, what a tough looking guy with smarts about the streets. And well, you'd be 100% right. I got my own graffiti tag and everything. The one with the teeth. Oh, that's what that is. Right there on the ground. Besides here, I got it on four buildings and dinners. So hey, do me a favor. Color in all my graffiti tags. That'll make them pop. If you do, I'll give you something nice. All right, here, this will be our last side quest of the night. How about that? I'll find the four the vampire teeth tags. I guess this was like badger teeth because I think that's a badger. Oh, hello. I didn't know I could fall in love with the company logo. But here we are! You did it again! Never cared that much for Slice, but that's just because I never saw it through your eyes. Breakfast, you show me the beauty and everything. Um... Dax said the worst pizza I've ever had is how... Somehow still from a chain. Hungry Howies. Don't know how they became a chain in the first place. All right, sword, no problem. I mean, I'm just gonna do these vampire teeth thing, which look at, there's one right there. And then I'm gonna wrap up, so you're not really gonna miss anything. Oh, I hope you have fun at the aquarium. I've never heard of a hung, maybe someone mentioned a Hungry Howie's, but I've never seen one. Um, the worst chain I've ever had is definitely Little Caesars. When you're when you're younger, you don't think about it. Just, oh, pizza's pizza, but I feel like as you get older, Little Caesars pizza is like pretty, like specifically the um, the five dollar hot and ready Little Caesars pizza is like really like the lowest tier you could get. It's like so much of it is just like bread, just bread. <laughs> It's not even like good pizza crust, because good pizza crust is like, hell yeah, I'm about to eat this pizza crust. But I do think their deep dish is better from what I remember, because I did get their deep dish one time. And I was like, oh, this is actually not bad. Yeah, Hungry Howie's, that's just a weird name in general, ain't it? Hungry Howie's. Hey, come on down to Hungry Howie's. We got all kinds of pizza. Man, dinners just ain't the same anymore. The color wipe really killed the vibe. This wall, for instance, used to have a beautiful mural. I see it every day and it inspired me to live a beautiful life. Without it, there's nothing to inspire me. Guess my life just sucks now. Oh yeah? I'll show you a, a mural. make some abstract art. Oh, oh, are you finished painting this wall? Yeah. Wow, looking at this, it actually doesn't make me feel better at all. How am I supposed to improve my life? Okay. <laughs> Crash, thanks. That's something to encapsulate how I feel. Guess you could take it to the plant exchange. Two screens left to here. They'll trade it in for plants. Wait, 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 whoa! 
there's a plant exchange? Because I found a guy who said, oh, you should pick up all the trash. Here's where the trash is. But he didn't give me anything for it. Looks like a fake brand you'd see in a TV show. Hungry Howie's, yeah. I'm going to look up Hungry Howie's and then Altoona Pizza as well. I have all kinds of trash for you. Oh, this is where you work. <coughs> Excuse me. You actually came. Well, this is the plant exchange. We'll take litter and trash and give you plants in exchange. It's a new program we initiated to try to clean up picnic. So if you spot any litter lying around, pick it up. And if you have trash, don't leave it on the ground. The bigger the plant, the more litter we take in exchange. Oh, so you actually go like buy them like a store. But it's like the currency is trash. Oh, it's a pangolin, is it? Okay, I, I thought like an armadillo. Uh, just judging by like the head or like a... Okay, a pangolin. Yeah, that that's, looks about right. A potted plant. Yeah. Desert floor. Um, big plant. We'll just get one of each. Sure, these will come in handy eventually. Oh, the plant types change, I think, because I don't think that was a bush there before, was it? Maybe it was, I don't know. Alright, I need to find two more teeth. Sharp badger teeth on some buildings. Okay, so there's one I found already. This isn't town, is it? Oh, look, people are going to the mural now. This is a really good mural. I feel like it shows a different side of you than we've seen before. It's cool that you're so talented, but you're still evolving and trying new things. Nobody appreciates you enough. Jeez, thanks. Yeah, I love seeing this outsider art. You've adorned this wall with your creativity and doing so snatch some power straight from the establishment. Although I guess the whole wilder thing enforces an ancient hierarchy with gatekeeping rules and power dynamics, which basically makes you the establishment of art. So I guess nothing actually transgressive happened here. <laughs> Just more of the establishment. Exerting the dominance over as common artists. Man, I hate that. I'm sorry. As an art student, I'm trying to keep up with the wilder's work. It's cool to see you take your skills to the streets. Is that, did I say it right? Well, I like it anyways. Hey, they like it. Mostly. More trash down. Uh, trash mammal. I just got a achievement. Oh, there's some more teeth. I think there's just one more now I'm missing. Wait, who the heck are you? It's like a, one of the guys from Monsters, Inc. Cashew. It's not letting me talk to them. Because I made the space button the jump, which is also the interact button. Maybe I should... It's never been a problem before, but it feels like right now specifically it's not letting me talk to them. Um, what am I doing? I'll just make it so that... Oh wait, I could just click with the mouse, right? No, I can't. Or X with the controller. There we go. Oh, hello. I'm here collecting trace samples of your color, actually. I'm an assistant to Dr. Cheese. She's really interested in the study of color theory. Well, I'm sure you've heard of her. If you get the chance, you should meet her. She'd be really delighted. All right, who the heck's calling me right now? Hello? Hey, it's Salt from the Clothing Swap. I'm trying out a new telemarketing strategy. I don't have anyone's numbers, so, uh... I'm just calling random phone booths. Thanks for being the first to pick up. We've got a brand new product here you're gonna love. Do you ever feel like you have too many clothes? Such a hassle to sort through them all, am I right? Well, worry no more. Our new product will solve all those problems and more. 
Your life is gonna be stupendous. Okay, what is it? Oh, come to the potluck and find out. Yeah, I'll think about it. Anyway, one more set of teeth. There's different tags too. Look at the cat winking. I keep going. It's funny, speaking of the tags on the buildings, earlier I saw this cat and I thought it was a person and I was like, why aren't you talking to me? And I realized it was a tag. Oh, it was on the big building? Uh, now when you say big building, Can I swim up this thing? Oh, I can't swim up this thing. Look at that. This one? Ah, there it is. Hang on, now I want to climb this. Now that I've realized I could climb some of these buildings. Oh, it's where the party is. Oh, there's a new friend here. Pistachio. Oh, now this is cool. I love a good rooftop party. The decor is perfect, too. This wouldn't be a party without this star camp chair. Thanks for making such a cool spot. Oh, and by the way, I want to pass along a friendly tip. If you place seeds from your decor anywhere in the world, wanderers like me will probably show up there. It'd be a neat way to make some friends, you know? See you around. Nice. I'm, I like that he's actually using the chair that I placed. Alright, let's go see about a badger, a certain badger somewhere. I think I need to approach from this way actually. Whoops, I need to go up that pipe. Too late now. Hang on, I wonder if I can... Okay, not there. Alright, what are you gonna give me, Stevia? Eh, I'm kind of a wild guy. I do what I want, and I don't care what people think. You dig? No, I didn't get Pickle the Brush yet. Is that something I should actually do? That seems like I shouldn't be doing that, especially now that I've learned that the brush is kind of potentially the thing that's corrupting people. Go color my tags on the buildings and diners. One left? I did all of them. There's one. Oh. There's one. Hang on. One. I thought I did four. Let me see. Two. I'm trying to be responsible and not do bad stuff. Like Sword forced me to give that those kids my my transit ID. And then look what happened to my new transit picture. This was the karma I got. Look. Look at this. I'm all squished. And for some reason the writing was coming out extra thick even though it was tiny, so I had to just write my my, my, uh, my given name. It's easier to fit three letters. Looks fine to you. Sword said they'd never seen that before. Whoa, what is this? Oh, it's the transit bird. Tamarind. 99% of people it works, but for some reason, for some people it doesn't. Oh, I don't usually see folks up here. I'm one of Picnic's transit flyers. I'm on break now, though. So don't ask me to take you anywhere. Okay, no problem. What's this gonna be? You came just in time, Joe. We're about to, to wrap up. The only reason I'm doing side stuff is because somehow I managed to do three chapters relatively quickly, I have no idea. 
how that happened. Teeth, teeth, teeth. Teeth, teeth, teeth. See? I don't know. Look at this run we got four already. There you are. Another lost kid to add to the collection. Teeth. Wait, did you see the missing teeth? It was below the bird tower? Wait, way up left? So below here, so you mean on a building below here. Ah, there it is. It was like dark, I feel like that one was like darker. Okay, there we go, that's all the teeth. Let's see what prize we get for all of this hard work. And it'll be the, the best way to end the stream, I'm sure. Oh, nice. All my graffiti tags are looking colorful and beautiful. Thanks for that. Take this. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, it's a brush style. I, that, I'm actually surprised. I don't think anyone's ever given me a brush style before. I think I always like just find brush styles. Um, I nicked that off some dorky art student. Okay, okay, I'm just kidding. It's a legitimate purchase and not stolen property. Just thought that would sound cool. Have fun with it. Ooh. We could draw straight lines with this one. That's why they make drawing straight lines so difficult. So that you could get an upgrade later. This is like an EA DLC strategy. People are always asking me, Stevia, how are you such a cool and tough guy? Trick is, you gotta stop caring about anything. Don't get attached to nothing or no one. Then nothing could hurt you. I don't play by the rules. Yeah, watch out, buddy. We live in a society. Oh my god. Did they really just say that? Alright, it's probably a good time to save. So I did one of the four trials, which is indicated on the map. I did the one down here in this corner. So there's three more corners we're going to have to visit. And then the final chapter after that, I think. So, pretty good so far. We've done three three chapters per stream. Um, let's go ahead and save. Alright. Alright. Pretty good, pretty good. That last boss fight we did with the mirrored, like, stuff going on was pretty interesting. I like that. So, we'll see what happens next time. Thanks everyone for joining. Hope you have a great rest of your, your Saturday night and your Sunday. And I'll catch you next time.